Welcome to The Awakening. I've just got a new webcam and it just looks so much better. Well, I think it does. Anyway, I'm so grateful to be here today. Um, doing what I love, having fun. I really am having fun at the moment doing what I love. Every single day I'm piling on programs onto Moving On TV. I'm bringing on new hosters, new hosters, no hosts, new hostesses, and having so much fun doing what I love. So the awakening has given me an opportunity to really, really wake up. What about you? Are you doing what you love on a day-to-day -day basis? So today, the awakening is about doing what we love, okay? Taking ourselves from the darkness, taking ourselves from confusion. I lost my job before this. I was confused. I didn't know what I wanted to do with my life. I was struggling. I wasn't acting. I wasn't singing. I don't even feel like I need to sing at the moment. I'm just contented doing moving on TV and working on my musical. That's all I need. And even though I haven't earned anything yet, not a penny, every single day gets me out of bed and I think, what program can I do today? What new program can I do today? Who can I bring on? What exciting human being can I bring on to Moving On TV to do a new program? And uh, what about a program about animals, about pets? Ellie and Peace keep nagging me. They want a program about animals. They want a program about pets. So if anyone is open to suggestions, then bring it on. Come on board, moving on TV. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for you guys. So that is taking you from the darkness into the light. So my life has become every single day exciting, a new interview, a new venture into doing tarot cards now because I qualify doing tarot. I mean, I feel like I'm 18 years old. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting younger every day, every day, every day. Meeting the most incredible people, telling their stories and yours as well, hopefully. So that's taking me into my awakening my awakening and the sun's just come out <laughs> is reacting to me my awakening is about getting younger my awakening is about getting vibrant and doing what i love my awakening is waking you up but today i'm full of light and full of joy i decided to focus on laughter to put up some messages from the cats <laughs> Um, my awakening is taking back my power and not letting anything, anything take that away from me. So what about you? What is your power? What would you like to do? What would you like to do with your life? You know, this has never cost hardly anything. It was set up, Moving On TV was set up by, by me and Jacob. Um, after we couldn't get on the media with Piaf, the show. So we set up Moving On TV so that I could do all my comedy and everything was about me, my media, my playground, because that's what it is. It's a playground. Life is a playground. Play, play, play. You know, you don't need to be bogged down about what's going on out there. Half the time we don't know what's going on. The other half of the time, we can't do anything about it. So just take care of yourself. Make sure you eat the right things and you get happy. Your vibration goes up and nothing can harm you, guys. Nothing, nothing, nothing can hurt you. So what I'm saying is do what you love. The message is to do what you love. Now, even if I don't get any viewers, and I haven't got that many yet, 
I'll grow. I'll grow because I'm doing what I love. And at some point, someone's going to sponsor moving on TV and we're going to take off like wildfire. I know we are. Like the bushfires that ended in Australia. This isn't going to end. This is going to take off like a positive virus of love and joy and highlighting the, 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 the darkness to bring it into the light because that's what I do every single day now for you guys. So today is all about what makes you want to jump out of bed and get going on it every single day. And don't give me, I don't have any money, I'm too old. People who know me know that I don't have that much money. People who know me know my real age, which I'm not gonna tell you, which you're never ever gonna believe. Because I'm getting younger every day, I'm proving it, I'm proving it. So there's no excuses. Have you got a computer? Yeah. What do you want to do? Contact me and we'll do it together. We'll do it together, guys. As you can see, I'm editing everything. I'm, when I struggle, I contact the beautiful Adobe guys and they take the computer over by remote and they make it work. <laughs> they make Adobe work. So every single day I can churn out programs, churn out programs, do what I love. So what do you want to do? Do you want to carry on being in the dark, working for someone else, coming home with no money? Not that it's bringing in money yet, but it will. It will. The more I focus, it's going to happen. Do what you love, guys. I, I learned how to edit when I was coming out of the wheelchair because I knew I had to do my own programs. Now I've got to create, I've got to get everything on the website, all the programs on the website, just in case we lose YouTube. I've got to figure out how to get all my programs I can get them onto Facebook and you can watch them because I can put the MP4s and I don't have to get them onto YouTube. But I need to try and get them onto my website and there is a way of doing it with Vimeo, I think, and because I, I, I'm not sure. I have to look into this. So if anybody can explain to me, how can I get everything onto a website without having to use YouTube? I want to create playlists, playlists, playlists. So while I've got YouTube, I will be doing that and you'll be able to watch the programs on Hope Glory Productions. However, uh, Squarespace does not take uh, anything apart from YouTube, Vimeo and Animoto. So I have to figure it out. This is my awakening. I might need another website for Moving On TV as Moving On TV is doing so well now. I have to figure out what websites can I put my programs on without worrying about YouTube, just in case I get cut off, because I am doing controversial stuff, as you can see. But I want you guys to be able to watch the playlist. So if you're enjoying The Awakening, you can watch them all if anything happens. Or if you're enjoying the lockdown series, you can watch them all. Or if you want to watch the holistic show, or the comedy show, or talent. There's all these different playlists for different people for different tastes. This is my awakening and I am so excited today with my new webcam. I love the colors and my hair looks like my own natural color. So it's me again. <laughs> people are asking me to go back to my natural color. God, I'm talking like an 18 year old. Suddenly the ego is everywhere when you're making programs. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying the awakening because today I'm not going to be in the darkness. Today I'm in the light. Today I'm in the colorful light of, of this new webcam that I've got and I hope you love it. Anyway, let's pull a card, guys. You know, I went outside today and I got some flowers. The flowers are everywhere. The flowers are everywhere. You can't not. <laughs> they literally greet me from the minute I get up. It's like the triffids. The triffids are taken over. <laughs> flowers. The minute you open the door, there's the flowers everywhere. <laughs> They're growing like wild, like madness. Isn't that incredible? Everywhere, flowers, buttercups and daisies. And I love it. The hippie in me loves it. Everybody knows since I was a kid, since I was a young teenager, 
uh, came to live here back from Israel. And the family, my friends, my foster family used to say, well, Lauren, you can't get the hippie out here, can we? I used to sit there eating lettuces and salads and they didn't understand. But guess what? It made me healthy, healthier than a lot of people. Okay, let's check a card for today. How to stay sane in a crazy world. How? How? Honesty, openness, and willingness. These cards are so synchronistic. Are you being honest to yourself? Are you doing what you love? Because I'm doing what I love every single day. Every single day, as Ralph Smart said, he wakes up with grapes in his mouth. Every single day, I wake up with what I love, which is moving on TV. And if, God forbid, the internet went, what I would do is I would still keep filming on my camera and I'd somehow get a screen and put it outside so everybody could watch the programs. I'd figure it out because when you're doing what you love, you just do it. How? Today you chose the card which is saying to be honest, open and willing. In life, if we are not honest with ourselves and others, we will be blocked in life and we will create more suffering for ourselves. If you don't open up and say how you feel again, you will not feel contented or safe. But you have to be willing to use the messages in these cards and do the things that help to make your life better. If you just read the cards and don't act on them, they will not work. So take some action from the willingness today. Today I will be honest with someone and say how I feel. So I can feel that I have healthy boundaries and I can lead a better, more balanced life. How to stay sane in a crazy world, guys. Back to front. <laughs> you have to laugh. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Now you can get them from me or you can get them from the Positivity Center. They have an online shop now. Um, or when we open, when they open, I mean, you'll be able to get them from them. Uh, now, Course in Miracles today kind of taps into what I'm saying here and says, whoa, sickness is a defense against the truth. Let's read it. I have forgotten what I really am, for I mistook my body for myself. Sickness is a defense against the truth, but I am not a body and my mind cannot attack, so I cannot be sick. Okay? My mind cannot attack. The minute I think of love, I think of protecting myself, I think of doing what I love. I feel like a million dollars at the moment. I feel like I'm 18 years old. You can keep Doris and you can keep whatever's going on in the world. I am okay today and I love every minute of it. And that's what it's saying. When you are doing what you love, when you live in love, like I interviewed Mitchell yesterday, he's incredible. Not for one minute does he worry about his life or his body. And he's going out there doing such dangerous work to try and save people. But he's in love with life. He's in love with everything to do with life. So he doesn't feel the fear. And that's the answer, guys. If you want to come out of here, contact me. Fear is false emotion appearing real, guys. This is the awakening. If you want to come out of fear, contact me. Please contact me and, and I will help you either through doing what you love. We'll find out what it is you love doing. We need to get a program on about life coaching, don't we? <laughs> Very tiny steps to achieving your dream on a daily basis. That's it. Get out of bed and do what you love. And if you can't do it, I will teach you. Tiny little steps. I got Martin on there now to do letting go in the lockdown. He's going to be teaching you very gentle hypnotherapy techniques. Letting go in the lockdown. You can do anything you want, guys. Anything, anything you want. You just have to find the tiny steps to do it. As I say, I learned how to edit when I was coming out of a wheelchair after a serious accident. Didn't stop me. I knew I would have to edit my programs because I couldn't afford Jacob anymore to do it for me. So I taught myself. 
and people complain and say, oh, you can't hear you, we can't see you, whatever. Let them, let them complain. There's not much I can do about it at the moment. I do my best, but it will not stop me. And I'm very honest. It says how, be honest, open and willing. I've lost teeth, I lost a tooth during the lockdown. And so I can't really open my mouth and smile that well. But I still give you these programs. There's no way I'm going to stop unless I can't talk at all. And then I'll have to get someone else to do the awakening. But at the moment I can. And until I can get myself to some kind of reconstructed dentist, I'm stuck with what I have. And um, so if you're on here and you know how to help someone who had rickets as a child, yes, I'm taking my D3 and I'm taking magnesium. I have got an issue with my teeth. Um, I had rickets. I was born with rickets as a child, the darkness. I want to come into the light. I want to know how to save them. I'm working on my eyes because the eyes are the mirror of the soul. Guys, you don't know how Lauren's going to turn up when you meet her. She could be a brunette or a blonde or you just don't know. She could be 18 years old again. <laughs> Become a, a young kid again. Do what you love. Come into the awakening. Bringing the hope and glory back into your life and moving on TV. If you want to come on the program, please contact me, movingontv1 at gmail.com. We've got all these new hosts and hostesses that are going to be making their own programs called the Lockdown Series. And this is part of it. I love you lots and I hope this makes you happy today because today I feel on top of the world making my programs with my new webcam and editing all these incredible things for you. So take care. Lots of love. And as I say, if you need any support, to find your dream, to come out of depression or need help with fear, dealing with what's going on in the world, just cut off the media. Stop watching and watch Moving On TV instead. Love you lots. Take care. Peace, shalom, salam, shanti, namaste. Bye. Mm -hmm.